I'm going to be going on a date by myself. Right, so I'm now at the restaurant. I'm by myself so I can eat whatever I want. If someone comes in right now, this would be a very awkward scene. Meal corns, what have I done? Hey meal corns. So today I'm going to be going on a very special date with a very special someone and that special someone is Drum roll, please. Mia. Um, yeah, guys, I'm going to be going on a date by myself. I am like quite excited for this because I feel like you guys are probably going to be like, Mia, what are you even going on about? How can you go on a date by yourself? That kind of defeats the point of a date. You're supposed to go on a date with someone. Yes, guys, I know that. But I am a single Pringle, but I still want to go on a date and I have no one to go on a date with. So I'm just going to go on a date by myself. How many times did I just say the word date? I love dates. Anyways, is this stupid? Is this weird? I don't know, but it sounds fun and I have nothing else to do. So I'm going to do it. So I'm thinking just because I'm going on a date by myself doesn't mean I shouldn't dress up and make myself look nice and also sort out this mess of hair. So I think what I should do is I actually should dress up and wear something other than jeans for once. I probably will end up wearing jeans, guys, like literally. I'm not really sure if this is right. Right, I feel like I'm probably going to have to try in about 10,000 outfits and then hopefully we'll find one. later I've ended up deciding on the first dress I picked out so all of that mess behind me you see yeah that wasn't necessary because all along I could have just chosen the first one that I chose anyways I am now ready to go on my date I'm feeling very glamorous and I'm excited okay Mia Kong so I'm now at the moor and I'm having an amazing time just going do my thing by myself, having a great conversation. <laughs> I just by myself, not talking. But I am thinking, I'm taking time to get to know myself. But anyways, we need something to do because if not, I just feel like if we're just walking around the mall in circles, that is going to get boring. I've got a bit of a dilemma here, basically. The nice thing about this is that I don't have to discuss it with anyone. And if I want to do something really weird and random, I don't have to make sure that that person wants to do anything with me because I'm just doing it myself. Person's talking to me. Okay, anyways. I've got a dilemma because I kind of want to like go to the cinema and watch a film because I feel like that's the sort of thing people do on dates and I feel like that would just be a fun thing to do by yourself because it's not something that you ever do by yourself. But at the same time, I'm a bit stuck because like I also kind of want to go on a meal by myself. If I go to the cinema and then have the meal, then it'll be better because then I have like something to talk about and it's not going to be really awkward in case I'm nervous on my date. But at the same time, I know that when I go to the cinema, I'm going to be like eating loads of sweets and stuff and then I'm going to be really full and I won't be able to eat my dinner. Yeah, I've got a bit of a dilemma. I think I am just going to go straight to the cinema because I want to see what's on at the cinema. So if they have something showing that I actually want to watch because another benefit of going on a date by yourself, you don't have to agree with anyone on what you want to watch. You don't have to compromise. You can watch whatever you want. Yay, we're here at the cinema. So I just ordered myself a ticket. Yes, guys, I paid for it. I know, kind of breaking the stereotypes here. The woman's paying for it. But you know what? I am a girl. Doesn't mean I can't pay for it. I don't need a man to pay for the ticket for me. So I ended up deciding on Dora. 
Now hear me out guys before you be like Mia, you're 14 out of all the films you could watch Why are you going for Dora? Basically, most of the films that they're showing at the moment are 15s And um, obviously I, I mean my birthday's in like two months So I'm not quite 15 yet anyways And I don't want to watch it, thank you very much Especially not on my own um, My stepdad and Sienna watched Dora recently And they said it was really good and really funny So I'm going to watch it I know it's a kids film but who cares? I like the sound of it and nobody else has got a say in what I watch so I'm going to watch it if I want to watch it. Okay, here we go Mia Corns. I ordered a regular popcorn and it's ginormous. I was not expecting it to be this big. It's as big as my head. So, um, and I have no one else to help me eat this. But anyways, let's go. It's empty. I really hope this is the right screen. This just took me 10 minutes to try and find my seat and it turns out it's because I thought I was ordering seats at the top of the cinema and I ordered some at the bottom. Why? Who let me do this? I'm just gonna sit at the top anyways because I don't think there was anybody sitting up there. So hopefully I'm not taking anyone's seat. If not, I'm right. I know someone was sitting at the top row because there's only like three other people coming and it's literally just me at the moment. So I'm just gonna sit right in the middle with this wall behind me and just just relax with my ice cream. Ice cream what? I'm not even eating ice cream, I'm eating popcorn. This is so weird. I've never gone to a cinema before where the chairs are like empty. Also they're rainbow chairs because I went to a kid's one. This is weird. If someone comes in right now, this would be a very awkward scene. The film is over an hour and a half later. That was actually like really good. I really enjoyed myself, even though like I was just doing it by myself. It was actually really fun. Like you think it would be boring watching a film by yourself, but it's actually not. And also another thing I really enjoyed about it was um, I actually managed to eat all of the popcorn. I thought because there was so much popcorn there, I was like sure I wasn't gonna be able to eat it all. But I actually ate it all, guys. I ate that full popcorn, but it did like last me to right to the end of the film, which is not normal. They have massive popcorn like this here. Okay, so now that I've watched a film, I felt like I've done something nice and relaxing on my day. Now I need to like treat myself, and I think going for a meal is something like everyone does when you're going on a date. So I just feel like this is gonna be like a classic thing. So I'm gonna go to a restaurant at the mall and um, see if they have any nice stuff. I have been here before. So um, I'm kind of excited. This is going to be weird though to eat there by myself because I've only ever eaten there with my family. So this is going to be weird. Right, so I'm now at the restaurant and I'm deciding what to eat. So I feel like normally when people go on dates, they try to eat something specially that isn't like super messy because obviously that would be embarrassing. But I'm by myself so I can eat whatever I want. Okay, so I'm definitely going to get a hot drink because in the cinema it was freezing. So I am really, really cold. So I need a hot drink. And then I think I'm also going to get a kimchi salad, but make it vegan, so. I'm, I'm actually really excited for this. Hi, yes please, can I get a Gigi decaf? No, okay. Can I get a cappuccino please with almond milk? Thank you. And can I also get the kimchi salad, but can I get it without the mayo and the burikake, so it's vegan? The vegan kimchi salad, please. What is really difficult about this challenge is I feel like it could be really easy to just sit here by myself on my phone. So I'm going to avoid going on my phone and like not go on it. So then I can just like sit here and just like think to myself and take some time for myself. Because guys, like I feel like it's really important. People always like take out time of their lives for other people. But I feel like it's also important to take time out of your life for yourself and just like do something for yourself go on a date by yourself like I have and it's actually like really fun and it's really enjoyable you think it'd be like a bit awkward or you might feel like embarrassed about going out by yourself it's actually not that bad and like it's not that weird coffee o'clock they actually didn't have decaf so I'm probably gonna go mental but considering I had three coffees the other day flashback that's rather a lot of coffees for you mum i don't know how i'm gonna survive after you know this the most hardcore coffee addict could handle this smear i'm a little bit worried about you <laughs> i don't know if this is really gonna affect me as much because you think that i would have built up some sort of tolerance for it but we'll find out later on in the day <laughs> guys i don't know if this is weird or not but whenever i like have a coffee and it has like foam on it i like love to eat the coffee I not love to eat the coffee i love to eat the foam I hope I'm not weird. It tastes like an actual coffee. I think this is my first coffee I've ever had that like tastes like 
coffee because it's like nice but also like not nice at the same time like it tastes very coffee and i don't know if i like that i always thought that i like the taste of coffee but now i'm like what did i just order right my salad has arrived and guess what i'm breaking all the rules i've got noodles that's what i said about you messy food when you're on a date by yourself you don't have to worry about that difficult I did also drink all of the coffee look guys I drank it all I actually got used to the flavor and then I started enjoying it again I think it was just because I've never had like a coffee that like really tasted like coffee before so I was just like wow this tastes um so strong and I wasn't used to it but now I think I kind of enjoy it I got used to it as I drank it so um now I just need to pay and carry on breaking um gender stereotype is that the word for it I did it. I actually went on a date by myself for the first time. That was um, actually like a really enjoyable experience. I actually really enjoyed that. Meal corns, what have I done? I'm having serious regrets about that coffee. It's honestly made me feel so weird. It feels like I can't breathe and my heart is beating so fast. Why did I do that? I'm like generally an energetic person I feel like so I don't need coffee I don't ever feel like I need it so I don't understand why I did that and now I feel crazy and like I can't breathe anyways guys if you're new around here make sure to click subscribe also check out this video here and that video there I'll see you guys in the next one bye